Hey. We'd worked to make sure the dinosaurs would thrive in the forest. Welcome back to Jurassic World Evolution 2. I'm Roth Games. I also accidentally started this cutscene. Uh, but here we are, mission number three. And, uh, yeah, Claire's just talking to us about some stuff. Oh, look at all the parasaurs. At home. In the forest. Oh, he's not cute. The powers that be oh, look at him rolling around. Yeah, I see you. Dinosaurs definitely do. Okay, okay. So Pennsylvania. All right. Uh, full disclosure: I didn't know that there was a cutscene there. This I hate. I hate this. I hate everything about this. I oh, this game just got a one-star review from me because of that. No prying eyes asking wordless questions. I don't feel much like answering. <laughs> now, call me crazy. You wouldn't be the first. <laughs> but we need to centralize our operations. And that's why I've chosen this location. Well, okay, I didn't choose it myself, but I was part of the process. <laughs> I got the memo. <laughs> the Appalachians have long been a place where people can kind of disappear whether on their own or with the help of someone else. So, why not the dinosaurs? Okay, so here you are, mission number three, Pennsylvania. I do find it kind of strange that it's right next to a... Grease a few palms, twist yeah, a few arms, and runway, just airstrip. Like that, the Department of Fish and Wildlife has a new base of operations. Now, we'll need to hit the ground running if we're gonna have this place ready for something it hasn't dealt with in 65 million years. The bare bones are established. But before the ones covered in flesh and blood arrive, we'll need it fully functioning. Owen okay. and Claire are already on site. Carnotaurus, all right. For you. Dr. Dua will be coordinating your activities. And me, I'll be managing expectations and staying an arm's length away from the meat of sources. <laughs> oh wait. Arm's length is probably not the best choice of words. The meat eating meat sources? Mr. Lambert? Standing by and ready to go. Just give the word. George Lambert is an expert ranger who worked okay. with us in the islands and is now with the DFW. He and Owen will deal with the dinosaurs while we address the facilities. There are a number of animals from your previous captures that will be coming your way soon. Delays okay. are unacceptable. Understood. We'll okay, so the Carnotaurus. We'll catch him. You keep him. Probably doesn't need that much room. Uh, okay, so mission number three is kind of where the game picks up in, as far as like complexity. It's where it really kind of starts throwing stuff at you. So this one might be a little bit longer than the last couple videos, but it's alright. Uh, let's see... Gate will be fine there, I guess. Viewing gallery, I know I'll need that here. Do that. Give me my path. There we go. It's a little crooked. It's alright. Uh, what's cool is I can actually, I can pause the game. You can pause the game and then build the enclosure. So that's what I'm going to do. And that way, it's ready for when I, uh, for when I want to put the stuff in there. I put a big old C in there for Carnotaur. I like sand, so I'm going to make this whole thing sand. After that, we're going to do some rocks. Same thing as always. Just throw ahead, throw ahead. Yeah, throw ahead some rocks in there and uh, get some of this and this action, that action, this action. Just make sure, you know, it looks good for the for the for the dinosaurs. That should be enough rocks. Uh, okay, so you need... 
You need some goats. And you need a spy bot thing, whatever this thing's called. Let's see. Oh man, I might actually need to put a couple in here. Eh, eh maybe not. Okay, so I'm going to do that. I'm actually going to put another one over here. Another, another viewing gallery right here. Just like that. And... Okay. Um, I'm going to try and make this a little bit strategic. So that'll come out right there. About here. Yeah, that looks good. Cut that here a little bit. And then... I'll do both. I Sorry, I was thinking about, like, should I just bring it to here and leave it at that? Or come down here? And then I figured, yeah, why not both? Maybe something can go inside here, I don't know. Um... Okay, that should be everything that the Carnotaur needs, right? Yes? No? I don't know. Facilities, operations, or... Whatever the... Yeah, operatives. Uh, get ourselves a... An emergency shelter. That works! Okay, so what do we've got? We've got a response team and a control center. We also need... Ooh, a science center. Staff center. That's a big one. We do need the, the staff center. Which the game does not like. I'm going to put that actually right here. Like that. Go ahead and get the path going. Because the scientists do need to rest. If they don't rest, they... Uh, they revolt. So, you know. There's that. Okay, uh, I'm going to get Expedition Center. Get that thing up and going. Like that. Put my path down. I love the fact that it lets you build while you're in paused mode. Paused mode? While the game is paused. <laughs> uh, and a medical facility, right? Did I already get this? I did not get the science center. Let me get that science center going. Right about here. Yeah. Get that corner nice and lined up like that. I like that. You like that? Okay. And the medical facility. Eh. What if I put you... Actually, I'm going to turn on angle snap. There we go. Will this fit? It won't be pretty, but that's all right. Right? Does that look good there? I don't know. Anyway, so now I think I've got pretty much everything taken care of. Yeah. Unless I want another response facility. Might be a good idea, but at this moment, I don't think I need it. Yeah, I think I'm good. All right, here we go. Go ahead and fast forward through all this. All that stuff can get built at the same time. <laughs> Here we go. Okay. Let's look at uh, let's look at research. Uh, ooh, efficiency upgrades. Yes, absolutely. I need that. Uh, what do we need? Wait, what do what do we need for that? F four. You and you. Bit overkill, but that's alright. Yeah. And our Carnotaurus are coming in. I will transport you guys. Let's see. Put them both in the sea. Yeah. We have new arrivals that will need food and housing. I'd also suggest keeping a close eye on these dinosaurs until they settle into their surroundings. Lambert's right. They've had a taste of the wild. Confinement may not sit well with them. Okay. We make no assumptions and pay attention to all the details. You might need a little bit more sand. Just like us, the dinosaurs are always learning. And you need to keep that in mind as you build another dinosaur habitat. Safety first. For them and us. Get it built. Then get the dinosaurs into the new enclosure. That about cover it, Doc. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
All right. Oh, I need to assign you. Assign that. Assign that. And assign that. It's how we roll in the Shire. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, that works for me. Make sure these guys are good. I don't think you require too much. Ooh, nice. Uh, training is good. Cost upgrades. Eh. Let's do training. Oh, yeah, see? You're already almost overworked. I don't know if I like that. Can I actually... Yeah, can I actually... Uh... Not do that and actually hire some more people, and I can. Okay, let's see. I'm gonna go through here and see who has good stats. Right now, you're looking pretty good with your genetics. You've at least got one of everything. I think we're gonna go with you. Yeah. Yeah, right? Yeah. <laughs> so, I'm gonna train you. Oh, is that not... Oh, I didn't... I'm an idiot. I haven't done that yet. Whatever. Okay. Have you been taken care of? You have. Okay, you're both good. That does not look comfortable. That does not look like a comfortable way of sitting. And again, what do I know? Oh god, look out, guys! He's coming! <laughs> He's coming! This actually, this is a nice little area here. I kind of like this. I might actually, uh... I, I don't know, I might actually, uh... I'm, I'm debating on closing up the sea and making this like a little air, like an island type thing. I don't know. That's a nice little visual there. So what do I gotta do? That's... These are both good. I guess I just gotta wait it out. I'm gonna speed that up then. Okay. Good, good. Uh, oh god, there's an Allosaurus coming in. So, because there's an Allosaurus coming in, like... Pause. D I don't want to take away from, from the game, but... At the same time, it's like, is there really much need for, uh... For hurrying here? Because I'm technically, I'm just like, yeah, pause it until, uh, until you're done. Then unpause it, and, yeah. That countdown timer means nothing, basically, to me. And then connect it. Done. So I've got a gate here. And I'm going to put another one here. Just for, just for ease of access. That way, you know, if they're in this enclosure, they can get to here. And so on and so forth. Okay. So that's there. I'm going to put one of you here. Just like that. Try and get it lined up with the path. Like that should be good. Hopefully. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. <laughs> It's fine. Um, okay. What else? What else? What else? We need rocks. They like rocks all over the place. So, who am I to take that away from them? Okay, we need water. Take that away. Maybe, uh, maybe I'll kind of continue the theming and, like, bring this water up and around here. Maybe this can, like, trail off into there somewhere. Bring that out a little bit. Yeah? Does that look good? I don't know. Uh, you need... one of these guys. And I'm gonna put this right here. Right in front of that viewing gallery. And... I don't know what else you... want. I don't know if you need sand or not. 
Oh, you need one of these guys. One of these little doohickey things. Do I need two of them? I might. I made this pretty big. Eh, whatever. There and there. Yeah. It's good for me. It's good for you. Right, do that. Do that. Stick that right there. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. You're too far away. Okay. Well, that's too easy. I can actually just go ahead and build another one right here. Yeah? Huh? Hmm. Well, that's probably not good. <laughs> right, stick that right there. Right? I don't know. Whatever. Whatever. About here. Do you like that? Do you like that? Yeah. yeah. Okay. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, speed up time. Let that play out like that. And we still got a full minute before the Alice Wars comes in. So that's built. I'm gonna go ahead and slow down time again. And then now. Yeah, now I can assign you. Okay. How are you guys doing? Why are... Why did you randomly trank my Carnotaur? Is it... Is it because he attacked the Jeep? Ah, interesting. I'm gonna go ahead and need you to, uh, you know, not be in a coma. It's a nice little area, right? I think I made a nice little paddock for this guy. Can I not do uh, skins yet? Nope, I can't. Okay. That's fine. I got the Allosaurus right here. He's fine. What are you guys doing? I'm not sure I'll ever be fully comfortable at the park, but the lab coats want to make sure the dinosaurs are, so <laughs> that's a job you should stay on top of. It's a beautiful game, isn't it? Uh, yeah, I mean, yeah, you've got all those things. Oh, crap, you're already here. Okay. I'm gonna need to get this right away. So far, you're looking all right. Huh? All right, I'm sorry. I, I, I'm sorry I made assumptions. Look at the moon back there. That's cool. I don't know what. Whatever. <laughs> Asset has been transported. What do you get? You're good. You need forest. You need more forest. Okay. One thing I do like about this is if I click on it and uh, do like that, click on this uh, comfort thing here. There's a button here that says influence comfort. So if you click on that, it'll actually show you stuff that you need. And. Uh, you're good on water, man. I know you are. But, yeah, so right now he says he wants more forest. That could just be because he hasn't wandered around enough. Whatever. I will give the aloe what it wants. Which more forest. So I'm cool with that. Go. What say you now? Yeah, you're good. Awesome. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Okay, so we got that. Dr. Dua and that guy Finch must be getting pressure from above because they want more animals rounded up. Check the expedition map and dispatch a remote capture team to a hotspot. I'll Easy. do what I can on my end. Okay, what do we got? We've got... Oh, Ankies. Okay. You need two. Sweet. Okay, the good news first. We've been achieving some success with our remote capture teams, which means a steady supply of dinosaurs to our control center. Now that I like. 
removing them from possible uncontrolled interaction with the general public is a 100% win in my book. Now to the bad news, which I always hate getting, but honestly, kind of enjoy giving. <laughs> These animals are arriving with an unknown disease. And we oh, fun. Get a handle on it post haste. That's management speak for a PDQ, huh? Pretty <laughs> quick. <laughs> Shut up. We can diagnose this disease with scans from our mobile veterinary unit. We'll get it under control before too long. That's good. Let's get to work. Nice. Okay. So, oh crap, I gotta... <laughs> uh, do you... What do you like? I don't like carnivores. What am I thinking? You're gonna eat the... No. Cool. Yeah, no, give me two minutes. Okay. I'm gonna go ahead and... Pause. So we can add an... Ankylosaurus exhibit. Where though? How much space do they need? That's the question. Hmm. Maybe like off here. Yeah. Let's do that. Okay. Uh, closures. I'm gonna make it. As big as it can be, because I don't know how many uh, other herbivores I'm going to have. So I'm going to bring that out to here. Yeah, okay. That's good. I'm going to add a gate here. Here. And here. And also one here. There. Okay, so that ensures that the cars can get it from this side, this side, this side. And then they can also get into the Allosaurus enclosure from there. Yeah, alright. Now I'm going to go ahead and get rid of this forest so I can see what I'm doing. Don't, I'm not. I'm not very familiar with Ankylosaurus, so we're gonna have to just see what it needs when it gets here. Water. I want to turn this down. Come on. There we go. New. No. I'm actually. I'm gonna go ahead and bring this out a little bit like that. Make you into a little thing like that. There you go. Okay. Let's see more rocks because those dinos be living those rocks yo I love this random orientation thing it's so nice and anything that takes the guesswork out of stuff is good in my book I don't know how much rock they need. So we'll just keep putting down a few more. Yeah, that should be good. I th think they like sand. So let's go ahead and make this sandy. Kind of similar to the Carnotaurus. Um, oh, you know what? They're herbivores, so... it m Okay. They might be like... The other ones. I'm gonna bring this down a bit. So I'm gonna do my tried and true method of just like layers of different things. So you know, all this garbage can be like around here, like that, and then I'll do ground leaf and ground fiber are big. So I'll do like a little section here, like that, and then ground fiber. Here. Yeah. Yeah. They should like that. Okay. What else do I need? I need one of these doohickeys. Even though, eh, whatever. It's fine. I can add another one there. Assign this. 
sure. Why not? Assign that and assign that. Okay, so there's that. I need a viewing gallery, which is. God, I'm still not used to these controls. Yeah, I'm gonna put you. Here's fine, right? How close did I put you to the. Oh, yeah, right up on the edge. Never mind. <laughs> okay, uh. Path. Out right there ish. Nope. Oop, that's gonna bug me. Maybe I'll maybe I'll bring you out first. Like that. Yeah, there we go. And you need a generator. <laughs> just put this, there we go. <laughs> it puts you right in the in the enclosure, just like with the stegosaurus. Alright, I th think that's good. I'm going to put another uh, shelter here. Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. Okay, and I'll speed up time. What has no power? Wait, why does it have no power? Oh. Alright. Okay. Are you good on stuff? Yeah, you're, you're good on stuff. Um, what about you? Are you good on stuff? You need fuel? Yeah, go ahead and fill it. That's one of the things that I'm just like, eh. I don't know how to feel about it. I guess it does add to a little bit of, of uh, I didn't mean to do that, realism, but I guess it's fine. Uh, Philip, yes. Okay, and you need to go here. One right there. One right there. Where was I? This guy. Uh, yeah, you're good, and I need to fill you up. What about you? Oh, you don't need that. What about you? You don't need that. But I would like to research some stuff, so let's see. What do we got? What do we got? I don't have enough money. Holy crap. Okay, well. That is the uh, the sickness that I need to do that cryolophil disease or whatever it is. But for right now, okay, now I can do it. So let's do that. Get you going. We need four. Okay, so ah uh ah -huh, ah. Uh -huh. See, see, see. Yeah. Right. Right. Okay. What is it? Cryptosporidios, whatever. Cryptosporatosis. I need to give you guys a status check. There we go. Maybe I'll be nice and go ahead and cover this up a bit. As much as I can. There we go. Okay, so where's that jeep? There he is. What are you doing? Why are you circling my Carnotaur? Okay. I don't know what that means when they do that. Here we go. Aha, they're sick and dying. But what do they need? They need ground leaf and ground fruit. Uh, they need ground fruit. 
Where's ground fruit? I gave you this. I gave you a ton of this stuff, man. All around here. See, I told you. It's weird. But hopefully that'll help. Okay. Uh, so I need to do what? Exactly. Tank. Add oh, you're already out there. Oh, crap. That's cool. Okay. Oh, I, I just need to wait this out, I guess. Where's the other guy? Disease contracted. You have to understand something. Owen and I signed on to this project because we want what is best for the dinosaurs. Why are you tranked? Not for them to be exploited or engineered, hacked and spliced and compromised. They deserve a chance at life as much as any other living creature. Honestly, perhaps even more. As the miracle of science gave them a second chance. So, do the research, find the cure, and then let's use it. The dinosaurs die. Again. And listen... That's not going to happen. Okay. Dr. Dua, this is Lambert. I've just received word that you'd like us to increase our capture effort. Look at that. I'm actually gonna... That's cool. I'm, I'm gonna take a picture of this. That's an awesome... Little, uh, visual there. Look, yeah, look at that. Right? Right. Yeah? Now that I think about it, I kind of wish there wasn't a big flare there, but whatever. Can you confirm? Yes, that's correct. We need to grow this facility, which means we need more animals. It's time to stress test our systems and make sure we're capable of managing wow. both the science and our operations. Understood. My teams are standing by. We still have a number of dinosaurs in the wild. Plenty of targets to bring in. Assets. And yes, this will be an ongoing mission for us moving forward. That's awesome. Confirming asset delivery. Oh, yeah, by the way, there's a, uh, there's a first person mode now. How's it going, man? How you doing? <laughs> but yeah, you know what? I think I'm going to actually leave this episode here. We're at a good stopping point. Like I said earlier, this is... This one is a little bit longer than the other missions because this one gets a little bit more technical. So yeah, with that being said, thank you guys very much for watching. Uh, if you enjoyed this video, please... Slap that like button like Will Smith, and I'll see you in the next episode. This is Roth Games, signing off. <laughs>